Hi, I'm Jeff Sankstack, the author of this Infinite Skills course on Adobe Premiere Pro CS6. In this movie, I'm going to explain all the things we're going to cover in this course. We're going to start off by talking about what exactly is Premiere Pro CS6. What can you do with it? What can it do for you? I'm going to explain the video production workflow with Premiere Pro at the center of that workflow. We'll start off by explaining how to shoot video, how to get video into your computer, then moving on to actually doing some editing. I'm going to go over what non-linear video editing is. Premiere Pro is a non-linear editor, and I'll explain what that's all about. We'll move on to setting up your system, your hardware, and also setting up Premiere Pro to best fit your workflow. Then we're going to move on to some practical stuff. We're going to start editing videos by bringing video and other assets into Premiere Pro. And by other assets, I mean things like an audio, could be a narration or music, or graphics or images. Then we're going to do some basic cuts-only editing, meaning we're not going to work with things like special effects or transitions at the beginning. We're just going to do some straight cuts editing. And we'll move on from there to trim and arrange clips to do some more fine-tuning to our editing. Then we'll make some specialized edits, things like ripple edits and rolling edits. Moving on from there, we'll add and adjust video and audio transitions. These go between clips to move from one clip to the next, like a dissolve or a wipe, something like that. Then we'll apply and customize video effects onto clips to cause the clips to appear different, look different, different colors, spin around, change size, stuff like that. Then we'll do some color correction, which is really important to the workflow. I'm going to help you make your videos look great. So I'll talk about all different ways that you can correct your color and also adjust things like brightness and contrast. We'll move on to compositing. Compositing is the layering of clips and graphics and photos such that you can see parts of one clip over another one, or you can do a picture in a picture, or you can cause colors to go away and have things appear where those colors used to be. All kinds of ways that you can layer clips inside Premiere Pro. From there, we'll animate effects. You can apply effects to clips, but you can also make them change over time using what's called keyframes. It's a hugely powerful part of Premiere Pro, and I'll explain all the different ways that you can animate effects. We'll create and add titles and graphics using Premiere Pro's very powerful titling tool, the Titler. It has all kinds of ways that you can add all kinds of beautiful titles with all different colors and other effects as well as shapes. We'll add, mix, and edit audio. So you can add all kinds of audio, including creating your own narrations on the fly, and then mix them together to a pleasing sound mix and edit them by trimming them and also adding effects to them like reverb to give them a little bit of depth to them. We'll talk about then finally, when you're all done, you've created your wonderful project, how you export your project. That is how you share it. You can create videos that other people can see on things like smartphones or broadcast television, all different ways that you can take your project and then present it to folks so you can share it with them. So as I think you can see, Premiere Pro has a lot to offer. So let's get started.